Hey you guys, I was editing all the pieces of the video for this week's challenge and my daughter was in the other room and she, okay, fighting cats. And my daughter walks in and she's like, what are you doing? Because you sound super snotty and bossy. <laughs> Little does she know I get paid to be snotty and bossy. Um, kidding, that's not, never my intention. I'm always trying to be burials. I'm working. I'm always trying to be gently encouraging. So the clips in this week's video are not meant to be bossy, but simply show examples of where I chose to take the stairs or skip the escalator or skip the people mover. It's with the best of intentions that I make these videos. So here I am at the infectious disease clinic going up the stairs. <laughs> um, what are you doing at the infectious disease clinic, Jenny? I'm actually just getting my second round of hep B shots from uh, our trip to Africa, but it always freaks me out to touch a handle at the infectious disease clinic. So here I am at the mall. Stairs are right in the middle. Anybody could be taking them. Nobody is. I mean, it's funny. People just walk right over the escalator. Don't even take a second glance at the stairs. Not a single person. There's somebody walking down the escalator. Just take the stairs. So I just finished a lunch meeting downtown and I parked on the eighth floor and I'm going up all eight flights of stairs. And uh, which is a good thing because I had a turkey burger and french fries and I told myself I was only gonna eat half of it and I ate all of it. So this is partially my penance <laughs> to make sure I do all eight flights. So here I am, my second home, away from home, which is the airport. So as you can see, I'm choosing to skip taking the tram, train, Delio, and I'm also not going to get on the walk-in escalator up here. Um, you know, really, honestly, the only people that should be on that walk-in escalator are those people that have suitcases from 1970s that don't have any wheels on them. Like, or if you got a broken leg or something. I mean, when you think about it, you've just been sitting for several hours on a flight, or you're about to be sitting for several hours on a flight, and you have an opportunity to move around a little bit, stretch your legs, and you don't take it. It just kind of goes back to our habits. Hello. <laughs> yeah, people think I'm totally weird talking to myself.